Hi Jasper. Hello everyone, Republic Jim here. I'm just out doing a late afternoon walk, getting some exercise for me and for Jasper. It's late afternoon on Sunday, the last day of 2023. And in case anybody is wondering, this is why I really haven't been doing any more content of camping in the snow or snowshoeing or dragging my sled around or anything. Contrast this to last year at this time where we had knee-deep snow and it was cold most of the time. Um, this year we've been above freezing frequently. Got a little bit of snow and then it's quickly going away. Today I think we're at about 35 or 36 degrees and it rained a little bit earlier. Now there's some fog rolling in and it's just generally not real pleasant winter weather. Just kind of dreary and drippy and no snow worth playing in. But I can still get out and hike in it and take the dogs out and that's easy enough to do when there's hardly any snow. So anyway, I'm gonna change the camera around and, and get walking. So as long as I have light, I'll still be able to do this. Um, I am wearing my black watch kilt for this walk. It's been nearly two years since I did a kilted walk and talk. That one was promptly censored and taken down by YouTube because I dared to share so-called medical misinformation, which in the intervening two years is pretty much all proven to be correct. But nonetheless, I still can't talk about that. If anybody's interested in that video, it's still online on, on my Rumble and Odyssey channels. I don't really tend to post anything on there anymore because it just wasn't worth the effort, but that particular video is there. So if you want to see what YouTube called misinformation, feel free to go and check that out. So yeah, you might notice I'm, as usual in the winter, just working on my cold adaptation and I think that's going pretty well, even though it's not especially cold right now. I'm still, Jasper, still uh, able to walk around comfortably in t-shirt and kilt. And with uh, one additional change, um, you can sort of see it. Yeah. Anyway. I'm not going to get too acrobatic trying to show that, but yeah. So walking in the snow barefoot kind of adds an extra dimension to that. It's a little slippery without traction from the boots, especially when Jasper pulls on the leash. And this slushy, icy snow is it's kind of challenging, but good practice. My feet are adapting well. Uh, also, notice that uh, I'm wearing this uh, chest rig here, which I got a couple months ago, and gives me some other options for gear and what I can carry just easily accessible in front of me there. Works well with a pack, even though I'm not wearing my full SAR pack, but just with this lightweight one, it certainly is easy to do. And I'm pretty pleased with it so far. Need to add a little bit more gear to it, but for the most part, it's set up the way that I would be using it. Woo. Um, Jasper, come. One other thing I wanted to, God, God. Jasper, calm down. Okay, that's getting kind of challenging with him circling around excitedly. I think he smells coyotes or turkeys or something. Um, anyway, one other thing that I wanted to mention is 
I'm also packing along this uh, Bowie knife that my father made for me for Christmas. And obviously it's not the time or the place to go into a whole lot of detail on that, but relatively soon I want to uh, do a video talking about the different knives that I have and uh, why. And you know, I'll go over more details of that knife at that time. So anyway, for this last day of the year, since I'm not able to pull a sled and do any fun snow camp outs or anything, it just with this weather, it really wasn't worth the effort to me, especially when they said it might rain again tonight. That's just nasty and I don't feel like dealing with it. So I thought I would just go out and do some walking around. Um, wanted to mention that I have quite a few ideas lined up for different content that I'd like to film in the next few months. I don't know how consistent I will be as far as getting content out because of course I work a lot and I have a lot of projects I need to get done at home also. And since nothing that I do on YouTube is monetized, I'm not making any living off of them. You know, it's just a hobby. So Jasper, come on. So I can't really spend a whole lot of time working at producing, you know, real high quality content on a regular basis or anything, but I'm going to attempt to get more out there more frequently. Of course, I have more workouts to do. That I have some fun ones of those scheduled. And um, of course, whenever we do get more snow, then there's other things that I want to do. I just recently got a large utility sled. I already had the smaller one that I've used in previous videos, but now I got a good size one that will haul a lot of gear. So I want to uh, get out when I have a chance and, and practice with pulling that and make sure that my self-braking system works as well for the large one as it does for the smaller one. And um, just over the last couple of days, I put some time into customizing the sled, getting some things set up for my purposes. So it'll be fun to try that out and see how it goes. I have some slightly crazy and unorthodox ideas about how I can make use of that in campouts. And I won't know exactly how well that works until I have a chance to try it and do the proof of concept. So hopefully that will be coming up soon, depending on what the weather does. If, ow, if the weather stays like this and the little bit of snow that we have continues to melt, then it's really going to play havoc with town's winter fest, which is now under two weeks away. That'll be on January 13th. And I'm not quite sure what the plan is if we don't have enough snow to do snow sculptures and outhouse races and everything that is planned for that. So we'll see on that. If we get snow and and those events take place, I might try to film some of that and, and put a Winterfest video up. But regardless of that, I have plans for various gear reviews and other uh, things that I find interesting anyway, as far as different techniques and emergency preparedness.
And Jasper's trying to tangle me up again. Um, okay. Anyway, uh, I also, in the next few days, plan to do a video about some of my thoughts for the coming year, but this is not that one yet. I will say that I watched a pretty good video about uh, predictions for the coming year by Bjorn Bull Hansen, and you can look him up on YouTube. I'm not going to bother linking that, but if you're interested in his predictions, I think most of them are pretty spot on. I have some additional thoughts um, just for our country in particular. Um, Bjorn is from Norway, so a little bit different perspective, but it's interesting to hear his thoughts on it. But I'll be doing that as I have the opportunity. Tomorrow I'm going to be pretty busy working on some projects at home, trying to make use of my time that I have. But anyway, that's about all for now. Just wanted to get out and enjoy the walkabout and, uh, you know, work on toughening up the old feet and, you know, get some fresh air, feel the wind beneath my kilt and all that. So, hope it's been interesting. I'll try to bring more of Jasper in some of the videos in the future, as long as he can settle down and and not yank me around too much. But anyway, that's it for now. This has been Republic Jim. I'll talk to you later.